Hello, my name is Nick, and my life is a shit show. So basically, today, um, I have no video idea, because my imagination is done. My dog is really afraid of um, storms, and it is really bad today, and like, she's real freaked out. And it's very stressful, because she just freaks out, and just runs around, and just doesn't know what to do, and she tries to dig into the drain of the bathtub, and that never ends well, like you could imagine. So, today, I thought, since I don't have a video idea, let's just record things and see what happens. You know, Grace Helbig calls it a stream of consciousness, and I am, in fact, conscious. And this is, in fact, a video. One could call it a stream. Who knows, though? One thing I'm excited about is going back to Disneyland. When am I going back to Disneyland, you might ask? <laughs> I have no idea. But all I know is that I really want to go back. Because Disneyland's just great. But you know what I don't like about Disneyland? Sleeping Beauty's castle. Because you know why? I don't like Sleeping Beauty. Aurora is a bitch. Let me tell you why. First off, why is she going to eat an apple from an old weird old lady? Like, I'm not saying that old people are bad, but like, why that bitch didn't realize this old lady who's creepy wants to give me an apple? Like, one, why are you gonna take it? And two, why would you eat it? Like, go down to the QT and buy yourself an apple. Like, are you kidding? And then you're gonna go to sleep. Like, you're dead. And then you need a man to come save you? and kiss you so that you can like be alive I find that problematic she's problematic Aurora is problematic I think that we should all sign a petition to get Sleeping Beauty's castle out of Disneyland like let's paint it and like give it to Elsa or something because I like her she's a bitch too but aren't they all there are quite a few things that I find problematic in today's society, and Aurora is a major one. But um, another thing is these phrases that come up with the youths, like lit. I know I use the term lit a lot in my day-to-day -day life, but like we just keep recycling different terms, just making them something else. Like, who decides this? And then who adopts them? Like, why is that an option? Like, why can't we just go in our dictionaries? Like, we have them in our phones. Like, it's called Google. Why don't we just look up the, like, the proper words? So that we sound educated. Maybe that's why people don't take the millennials seriously. Because we sound stupid. So don't get me wrong. Like, I like the terms, like, for a little bit. But, like, it gets to a point we're like, how long are we gonna use them? Like, how long are we gonna sound uneducated? And like, I know some of them are like fine, but like YOLO, like why was that a thing for like so long? I know people that still say that phrase. It's just an excuse at this point. Like stop saying it, say something else. But the phrase lit, let me tell you something, that phrase is lit. Love that phrase. And you know, maybe I'm part of the problem. I'll say that I am part of the problem, but you know what? There's just, there's a time and a place for it, and too many people don't understand that. That's the issue. So moving off from this topic and going to a less heated place in my brain, I am 1000% fascinated with Club 33 at Disneyland. So if you don't know what Club 33 is, it's like this exclusive, like, members-only club at Disneyland, and... Like, you have to be on this waiting list for a certain amount of time, you have to pay these outrageous fees, and like, it's so limited, and like, I want in. And I probably only want in because it's like so limited, because, like, who doesn't want that? Like, I'm a sucker for that kind of thing, and it just sounds like a great time. Like, no one else can get in there, so I want in there. And you know what? That's what keeps it going. But all I know is that Britney Spears had her 33rd birthday there, and I want to experience it. I realized today that I could buy the exclusive, like, Club 33 ears, like the Mickey ears, on eBay. They're $100. 
if I had $100 in my bank account, I would have them. Maybe I'll start a GoFundMe. Maybe not. I probably won't. Because people actually need GoFundMes. I don't need a Club 33 hat. Maybe one day I will get one. Fair and square, because I'll be a member. I just want the exclusivity, y'all. Okay. My other life goal, major life goal, is to get a G Wagon. I don't know if y'all know what a G Wagon is, but it's one of those box Mercedes things, you know, Kylie Jenner. It's what she drives all the time. Either her and her Rolls Royce. Mm, she is also problematic. Can't deal with her. But that's beside the point. I love G-Wagons. I always have and I always will. I remember my dad used to work at like a European service center and so they would work on the G-Wagons and this girl came in and her dad was like the head honcho on the military base here and she had like a vintage G-Wagon. Oh my god I loved it and I want it and I will get me one. One day I will have one I hope. I definitely can't start a GoFundMe for that because no one is going to give me $200,000 to buy a car. So the next thing that I want to talk about is that my camera hates me almost as much as my hair hates me. I don't know why, but like my camera keeps like cutting off at like at four seconds. Like every time I like turn my camera off and then turn it on again to film another clip, it like turns itself off. I don't know why, but that is problematic. Just like the fact that I still can't mute things. I have made three videos before this. I should know these things. Like, I should, like, figure it out. Like, hey, like, that happened last time. Like, let's fix that. No, that's not my style. Not Lily Sings. Lily Sings? Who am I? I know her name is Lily, Lily Sing. She is not Miranda. But I love Miranda. Anyway, I just I really am into this video making. Like, it's fun. If you've ever had, like, this shred of desire to do this, like, do it. Like, it's fun. It's a little stressful, because, like, I'm trying to think about, like, what am I going to make a video about? I don't know. So just do it. Like, I'm just doing this. This is going to be terrible. Maybe it'll be great. But you know what? What we've covered in this video, let's have a quick recap, is that I don't like Aurora, the princess. I have beef with a Disney princess. And that my life is just basically very boring. And I ramble a lot. And you know, you know what else? You know what else? I still have the Britney key cards on my desk because bye. So subscribe to me. Mm, Britney out.